back with nobody if you guys have dudes evo is going down this weekend that some of you may be wondering what is evo it is only you know it's nothing crazy it's only the biggest fighting game tournament in the whole world and the only reason i'm talking about it today well there's multiple reasons one because i love evo when it comes around freaking huge smash tournament it's going to be crazy and it has been the past couple years so i'm looking forward to it but there's a lot of speculation going around will nintendo reveal a new character for Smash Bros. Ultimate. A lot of people are speculating. Maybe they might show a character. And that's what I'm talking about today. There's no proof showing that this might happen. But I have a feeling. Because of what Nintendo has tweeted. And just a couple other reasons why I think this would be a perfect time to reveal a new character. I have a feeling we may. May. Just be getting a new character reveal. Sometime this weekend. Probably when the Wii U Grand Finals are going on. Like. Maybe right before it starts or something like that. I don't know when, but I have a feeling soon and here is why. Reason number one, it's been about two months now. Not quite, but almost two months since E3, which means two months since we've gotten any significant Smash news. We have had the Smash Bros. blog and they've put out some updates, but nothing they've posted has really been significant at all. They have posted some music tracks that have all been fired, don't get me wrong, but other than those... We haven't gotten new information really at all. They have given us some updates on stuff we already did see. You know, they gave us some more information on some items and stuff like that. But nothing really new. Although, I say that, but yesterday we did just see that Delfino Plaza is returning. So there is that. But other than that, those very slight minor things, we haven't gotten much new information from that Smash Bros. blog update for two months. Dude, two months. So I think it's about time for a new character to be revealed or if not a new character at least something new about the next smash game we don't even know what the menus look like we don't know what game modes are going to be in the game literally all we know is that everybody's returning and that's it so right now two months you know the game does come out in december so let's not forget about that so we're in august now it's been two months since our last information i think it's about time we get some type of new information on smash so that's my first reason reason number two it's the biggest fighting game tournament in the world, and it's going down this week, and Nintendo has already been tweeting the Nintendo Versus account. They've already been tweeting how they're there, and I want to point to one specific tweet that they just recently tweeted that's got me, it's got me feeling some type of way, dudes, because it's starting to make me think, wait a second, does Nintendo have something? So here's what they tweeted. They said, We're in Las Vegas for EVO 2018. That action is going to heat up throughout the weekend, so make sure you stay tuned. Now, when they say stay tuned, they could just mean, you know, stay tuned for all the matches. Stay tuned for the tournament excitement and stay tuned for all the hype. Which, don't worry, I'm going to be tuned in for all that. You already know what it is. But I have a feeling that's not what they mean. I think when they say stay tuned, they're saying, hey, motherfucker, stay tuned because we got something to reveal to you guys. Now, yes, that's me reaching, you know, that's me being a little hopeful, but maybe, dude, you, you know Nintendo, man. Maybe, just maybe. Now, I know the odds of them revealing a character at Evo may look slim to many of you, but that brings me to reason number three. Nintendo has been extremely supportive, or at least it seems that they're extremely supportive of the competitive scene now of all their games, really. Competitive Splatoon, they've had the Invitationals at E3, although they've always done the Invitationals, but yeah, they had the tournament at E3, and they have this whole new Twitter account, Nintendo Versus, that, hold on, your destination for, Ni this is, this is their bio to the Nintendo Versus account, your destination for Nintendo fun competitive updates. Nintendo is supportive of the competitive scene now, and it even looks like Sakurai is even putting things in Smash Bros. Ultimate that literally are for the competitive scene. For instance, the turning off stage hazards. Now, that's just a good feature whether you're competitive or not, because some people just don't want the freaking big old yellow devil beating them up, and they don't feel like they're really the reason that they're the reason they're losing. No, they think the reason they're losing is because of the stupid yellow devil, so it's a good feature nonetheless, but that's something that the competitive scene has been wanting for a long time to turn on stage hazards because there's so many good stages that could be legal and competitive but they have these stupid hazards that nobody wants okay maybe i went a little over the top maybe some people do want them but to see them being able to turn be turned off that just seems like something that sakurai did 
for the competitive peeps, dude. And that's awesome. But not only that, also now Sakurai made it. So now you pick the stage before you play, which what do they do in tournaments? They agree on the stage they're going to play. You know, they do their little handshakes like, and they pick their stage together to decide what stage, you know, they say, oh no, this stage is banned. And they pick their stage before they even pick their characters. So then they can, you know, they can choose what character they want based off the stage they're going to, dude. I'm telling you, not only is Nintendo supportive of the competitive scene, Sakurai, even though he still believes the game is mainly a party game and meant for fun, which, hey, that's fair, it's a fun game, and it, I, use, I would use it for a party too because it's freaking fun, but he's also showing love to the competitive scene too now, and I just, now's the perfect time, because no matter when a Smash Bros. announcement is revealed, it's going to gain hype no matter what, but then you combine that with how big EVO is, it's literally a worldwide event, people travel from Japan to come down to EVO, this is huge dudes, this is gigantic. And you know, Ryu isn't Smash, you know, Street Fighter is another obviously huge game on EVO. I just think literally it is too perfect and I just have a feeling that it may just happen this time around. Let me know what you guys think. Do you think that Nintendo will actually reveal a character? By the way, if they do, my prediction, right, if they do reveal a character, my prediction is King K. Rool or Rayman, one of the two. Rayman is going to... I just gotta say this real quick, Rayman is gonna be in Smash Bros, I'm telling you, no matter what, he's a guarantee, Ubisoft and Nintendo are literally blood brothers at this point, Rayman's gonna be in the game, but I think it's either gonna be King K. Rool or Rayman if they reveal a character, well, whatever the next character reveal is, that's who I think it's gonna be, but nonetheless, who do you guys think is gonna be revealed, do you think anybody's even gonna be revealed, or anything's gonna be here about Smash Bros Ultimate, oh, real quick, I would like to point out, if you're still around, because you probably thought I was ending the video, but if you already left, you're missing this, but if you stuck around, I got a little bit more to say right now, real quick. Uh, in that post about them saying, you know, stay tuned, they also posted a picture of, you know, a poster of Smash Bros. Ultimate, uh, the little home run, you know, home run sack, and then obviously Evo. And I don't know about you, but look, Smash Bros. Ultimate, right? They're going to hit a home run of an announcement at EVO. Okay, I'm looking too much into it now. But let me know what you guys think, and I will see you guys in my next video. Peace. <laughs>